uh, keep each other accountable and uh, see what other pro people's progresses are. Um, and post and share other great courses out there. Um, so um, you, can, you can see reviews of the other people who's taken it. And also you can leave a review if you want. Um, once you enroll, um, you'll start with um, other people and keep the progress going. So that's the, basically the idea. Um, uh, and then we had a React version of it because we started off with the React as our framework. Um, and then we wanted to finish this with uh, the basic MVP. So uh, uh, yeah, Ethan is going to show us the React version. All right, so we created this React to do a uh, collaborative goal tracking um, app. And um, React was something that none of us had any prior experience with, so we decided to. Um, um, was Zoom something out. that we can learn on the go, and Zoom um, out. with React, um, it's a uh, Zoom out. Base. Zoom out. You want me to do it? Check it out. Is that cool? Yeah. 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 So it's a component-based. Um, version, front-end version of JavaScript, and you create pieces and you bring them all together. Um, so this is a single page app, and um, so this was kind of our, our landing page, our hero pick, um, and as you scroll down, um, again, you're, you're prompted with a, a login and a sign up, um, and um, this is more of the, the framework of what we were looking. Um, we used a very powerful um, library, uh, CSS library and styling library. I call it Michelle. It was all her. Um, and then my kind of pride and joy, see this button here? Which would be yours. You'll see that I fucked up. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> First one. Kind of um, and you can go ahead and write reviews. Um, awesome. And um, it will post if I click this. I won't. Trust me. It will post. Um, and um, but no. Overall, this was like a great experience. I uh, we actually really enjoyed getting to get our uh, hands started with React. Um, I would pull up some of the code and do like a brief lesson. I'm going to say that for uh, Michael or David or whoever is teaching that class. Um, they'll probably do a better job with less cursing. Um, but I do want to talk a little bit about the challenges we face. Um, there were one or two, you probably can't tell from this presentation, because um, it's so polished. Oh, yeah, sorry, I wanted to show one more thing, because check out what Michelle, the Michelle Library can do. Um, this is pretty cool. Um, so this is where you would track you know, the progress of your goals, what you've done, who you're kind of competing with, or you know, collaborating with. Um, and I was on here, I'd probably be number one, but we didn't want to. You know, I'm humble. Uh, and so this is generally, you know, the, the framework we started with, and then as we started implementing the back end, um, when you do React, you have a front end server, and you also have a back end server. That's like where the data is getting posted. Um, the way we did it, we had a little bit of a struggle with having a front end server talk to a back end server, like running simultaneously, which is captured in these slides, this single slide. Um, so challenges. As I just mentioned, um, when you create a React server, um, it updates um, continuously right away. Just like when you make a when you save a change, it'll refresh the whole page um, and it'll capture that state. Um, when you're trying to push that to Express, there are problems. Uh, we learned this uh, firsthand. The second point I want to talk about is um, again sending posting requests and controlling state. Um, there was probably a third challenge here. Um, but I crushed it, and I removed it. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, regarding the challenge, I think one of the biggest challenges we had is kind of setting our own expectations. We started off the project with React and realized that uh, we needed to learn the entire framework within like, a couple of days before we get started. And so that's what we took on, um, and I realized that we were not going to have the minimum features as an MVP that we we promised ourselves, so that's why we switched to um, sort of the um, ad hoc mode um, that we presented first. So 
my promise to you guys is that I think, I still believe that this can be a great platform for us as a class. Um, and I, as a promise to you guys, um, Michelle, I, and the rest of the team uh, <laughs> will be committed to finish this app with React um, by end of this course. So at the end of this, uh, before July, July ends, we will have a cool platform where we can post and share other great online tutorials and we can keep each other's progress. I think it'll be a great level for all of us. Um, and it won't be a to do this, we promise. Thank you. I didn't sign anything to agree with that, but yeah, <laughs> we'll get it done. Get it.